Hello, Beard Brotherhood, our friends, our family. Today, we are outside in the wonderful outdoors, enjoying the summer sun. Jonathan, what are we doing? Today, Sean, we're going to be looking at these beautiful drinks in front of us right here. The new Kopenberg hard seltzers. So we have passion fruit flavor, we have black cherry flavor, and we have mixed berry flavor. Exciting. Exciting time, exciting time. Brand new product for Kopenberg. First four right into the market, 5%, 93 calories to this one. I don't know if they're all the same. Yep, yeah. yeah, all the same, all 93 calories. 1.7 units, uh, 250 ml can. Yeah, I think pretty good. Yeah. And uh, what exactly is a seltzer for our UK based friends? Because we don't have these weird things. It's basically just alcohol water, mate. That's what it is. Yeah. Sparkling water. It's just low calorie, sparkling water with alcohol. Spike the flavour, that's what it is. Good show. So on which one? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo? Well, which one are you fancying the most out of them? Passion fruit. Passion fruit. Should we go for the worst one first then? Okay, black cherry. Black cherry. These are very clear. Looks like lemonade. Tastes like... Not sure yet. Yeah, I've tried it. So, how much it? Very sweet. Yeah, very. It smells like a sweet. It smells like cherry sweet, doesn't it? It smells like a, uh, yeah, a cherry tank plastic. Yeah. You know, Harry Bow. Yeah, sour cherries. Sour cherry. Good. Same thing. I think I might like this one. This is what I was hoping the actual hot of cherry would taste like. Yeah. But what a fucking good point was that one. Yeah. Hopefully the same as it. That's fucking disgusting. Ugh. <laughs> you expect it to taste like it smells, and it doesn't. It does not. No. I'm, I'm not quite wretched like you are for no. this, but it's I, not. I'm wretched because it reminds me of something from my, my past childhood. How young were you at this point? Three, four? Twenty-four. <laughs> no, it's uh, not for me. It's very snappy. You know, like you've got a snap flavour. Yeah, so I see what you mean with that. It's not very nice. It's know. disappointing if it's not as nice. Yeah. It smells like it'd be quite nice tasting, but a little bit flavour. It tastes nicer when you sip it. Yeah. Um, not when you gulp it, like I did the first time. Um, we're going to score these as a trio and a as a, a brand, do we? Yeah, we'll score, we'll give it an overall score, but I think we should probably rank it at the end. Yeah. Like, say which our favourite and least favourite is. Right then, let's try the, uh, the passion fruit next, shall we? Passion fruit going in. Ching ching. It smells fruity, it smells very floral. It does, yeah, this strong passion fruit smell on that one, isn't it? It's a little bit unusual, the fact that it's just passion fruit, it's normally orange passion fruit, isn't it? Most of the time. Well, they're saying that Cop Big have got a Cop Big cider on there as well. They do. Yeah. I think that's where they're going, aren't they? Yeah. They're probably trying to take what they've already made and put it with water. Yeah. And so far, it's not working. This I mean, is better than the last one. This one is. This one actually tastes yeah. like passion fruit. This one is nice, to be fair. Still not a strong taste as it smells, but it's a lot better tasting than the black cherry. Yeah, the black cherry is a bit too. It's like a, a mirror. Yeah, it's fake, it's not It's not real. I mean, you, you, you can taste it, but then you can also be like, what the fuck is that about? It's disgusting. Anyway, can you taste mirrors? I don't know. That's very nice. It's like a mirror. You taste it, but it's fake. <laughs> Back on that track. Yeah, I know what you mean. The, the black, the cherry one, the black cherry. It just it's not a strong taste for it, is it? It's just like you say, it's like a snapsy, alcoholy taste to it. There's a little, little bit of cherry to it, nothing like that. I, I find the word John. I do agree with you. A mirror. It's not a mirror. It's a mirage. Mirage. <laughs> that makes a lot more sense than a mirror. Yeah. <laughs> This is the quality content you, you come here for. Exactly. Two Welsh boys talking shit about stuff they don't know anything about. No. Perfect. Absolutely, um, mate. Yeah, past is a lot better, basically. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you um, can actually drink this one. I would. Yeah. I wouldn't be disappointed drinking this one. No. If I had to say I had a case of them, you wouldn't. But if I had a case of them, I would drink the first one and be like, oh god, I'm not more them to get through. Whereas these, I could drink this one. Yeah. Not the best, but I could drink it. Hopefully, Prince Road is more this side than that side. 
Yeah. Although I got the feeling it's probably going to go in the middle. So, John, this one is mixed berries. Will this one taste like a mirror? No. But, okay. It smells like you've mixed the yogurt and the coffee. See, that's what I think strawberry and lemon. Yeah, I can see like. that. I can see that. And that does smell like, you're right, it does smell like a yogurt. You know what? Uh, it's, it's, also, it's, it makes my bones go stronger. Petty flu. Petty flu, yeah. There you go. That's like a petty flu. Are we allowed to do accents? <laughs> this is the second video. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, why not? <laughs> Nothing offensive, it's fine, don't worry about it. No, I'm just pretending to be a little, <laughs> little girl from the foreign land. And that's normally Tuesdays. <laughs> <laughs> but it's Monday today. <laughs> anyway! Ching ching. Mixed berries going in. I think you're right with the middle ground. Um, it's nice though, it reminds me a lot of the taste of an actual pot of egg. I mean, yeah. the berries are synthetic, you know. The cup big berry yeah. taste. It I mean, doesn't taste like you're eating a berry. It no, tastes yeah. like a drink of berries. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And anyway. In a way, they've actually managed to capture perfectly their ciders here, haven't they? Because this one is quite flavorful. This one tastes like a cider, and this one is shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah so there we go. Yeah. I mean, this one, it's if fun. you do miss the real winter or uh, summer fruits that they used to produce. This is for you. Um, yeah, it's okay. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Like I said, I think passion fruit's nicer, but it's yeah. not too bad. This is nice, soggy, smooth yeah. flavor as well. It's like, a, like you said, it does feel like, tastes like you eating a yogurt. Yeah, it's, it's still that weird kind of, when you say fruity yogurt taste to it, having a like creamy, yeah. fruity taste to it. Does it have milk? No, it's vegan. So, <laughs> if you do want, and they'll keep creamy flavour in your mouth. <laughs> and you're a vegan. <laughs> and you're a vegan. You've got to try this. Fuck's sake. <laughs> or come. <laughs> in terms of price, please. These are £2.20 each. But I have seen them reduced to about £1.80 a can each as well. So they're about that £2.00 ish month. Uh, average. Average. Yeah. Longevity. I mean, okay, so you've got your black cherry, which is a no. This is the no. I don't know. John's the yeah, baby. Um, passion fruit. See, now I'm drinking this a bit more. This mixed berry. Mm. I'm over here. Yeah. And then this. Oh. oh. So you think this is better? Yes. Right. See, I don't know, because this isn't unpleasant, but I'm not sure if I prefer it to the passion fruit one. Just gets a little bit weird to be drinking a yogurt. I don't dislike it. But I think I prefer that one. Okay. Maybe if we just do But then we're kind of showing some superiority either way. Let's do it. There you go. These are both good. That one's shit. Yeah. This, Avoid that. This one's not very nice. I wasn't expecting high hopes for this one anyway, because from the last Copperberg cherry we tried. And you can watch that on John's face. Um yeah, that wasn't great either. So, yeah, so as a score, as a unit, what do you think about these seltzers, John? I think, they, I, I think that one dragged it down. Yeah. It does drag it down. Do they do the job? Do they do what you wanted it to do? No. No. Okay. <laughs> no, because I wanted it to taste better than it does. I wanted it to taste stronger than it does. Yeah. A bit more and fruit. Yeah. I don't think any of them taste as strong as they smell. And so in that way, they're a little bit of a disappointment. But yeah. spat these, are, these are better, that much better. Yeah, it's a spat in water. I mean, if they infuse it, yeah. I, don't know, I don't know what a seltzer is. I don't imagine it is just spat in water, but... Yeah, it, that, that's, that's basically it. Yeah, I, I don't understand it. It's just to be low calories, that's all it is, man. Is it? Be some of our in shape, isn't it, you know? Well... Now, we, now we're easing out a lockdown, we're going to be in the beach soon, fighting over, you know... Umbrellas. Umbrellas, <laughs> towels and shit. <laughs> Barry Island. Exactly. Excellent. Um, so as a unit, no, it doesn't do what it, we want it to do. No. Uh, it doesn't bring the, the power of the, the fruit flavours along with it. Price is, you know, just, it's fine. It, it's price a standard price for any of these kind of mixed cocktail drinks that you yeah. can get. Your you mojitos, your, you know, your yeah. cotton bows, all that sort of stuff. Same kind of, they're all around that two pound dish mark. And they do meet that mark. Uh, longevity. Um, no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't drink them with mine because it's just, just that, that horrible 
aftertaste of the snap or, or possibly the sparkling water, I'm not sure what it is, but it's not that aftertaste and I don't like it and I won't drink one. And if I did drink one, it'd be either this one or this one. Yeah. Um, John? I'm, I'm in a bit of two minds because I think I probably could have a couple of these two. Definitely not of <laughs> yeah. these two. Just, yeah, just get rid of that. That would normally be a waste, but not. <laughs> That's too good for that. I think it might be very re see refreshing. You know, to have a sparkling water. Maybe with some ice. Yeah. Yeah. Like a summery drink, it'd be quite nice. It'd be quite an easy drink. I think you could drink a few of these. They'd probably give you surprisingly pissed along the way. Because you wouldn't really think you're drinking a lot. They are five percent. Yeah. So let's go for an overall score. Um, I'll go first on this one. Let's crack on. I'm gonna go with a six point three. Six point three for um, a couple of the card seltzers. Oh yeah. Picture. I think. I think you're right, mate. I go a little bit higher. Well, I think. I don't know. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll go for a six point seven and bring it to a nice six and a half. Six and a half. Because I think that's a bit reasonable. Right. It's a reasonable Again, score. I think it'd be a little bit higher if that piece of shit wasn't there. Yeah. Because those two are quite, they're not great drinks, but they're quite pleasant drinks. You could drink a couple of them, but yeah, six and a half is pretty fair. But again, this is the run of the litter. Don't drink this, drink these. Mixed berry, passion fruit, drink those two. Not that. Fuck cherries. <laughs> New t-shirt coming soon. Fuck cherries. Because we've uh, already got a fuck ton of water, which you will see in the next video. Because, well, not the next one, because we won't be drinking to my board. Or anything that we should be drinking to my board. But fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> and on that note, goodbye, Beard Brotherhood. Hit that like button, leave us a comment down below, subscribe to the channel. Go on, we know some of you watch this. Hit that subscribe button and make us rich. Fuck it. We'll buy more of these. Maybe. Probably not. But yeah. Anyway, thanks. Make us rich, baby. Bye. Bye-bye.